you are watching Free Life Free Spirit Channel. My name is Vedran Bajun, I'm adventurist, artist, writer. Right now I'm again in the jungle and today I'm gonna show it to you if you get in the middle of the rain, if you get stuck in the middle of the rain, hard rain, how is the best way to make a sh very quick shelter. Stay tuned to watch this video. Like, like I told you in my previous videos, always follow the water. If it doesn't have water, follow the water stream. Water. I am in the middle of the jungle and right now this is the way that I'm using dry riverbank. It's not the riverbank, it's a stream, stream bank. Small mountain stream, jungle stream. But I'm gonna use it. Why? Because this bank, in special forces we call him Vadi. This Vadi, dry river, river bank, is made because of the water, of running water. When it's raining, hard raining, the water creates waves like this. Be sure, every time you find something like this, follow it. Doesn't matter, with water, without water, follow it. Follow the eddy, because... Vadi, because Vadi will take you to the river. Right now, my goal is to find the river that, that I can feel more comfortable, less claustrophobic, normally, around me right now is a stick jungle over there close to the river I hope it's gonna be a little bit open so that helps a lot with the mentality with anxiety and stuff like that so please always when you find something like this follow it be careful because it's very humid very humid a lot of lot of predator snakes could be inside so be careful open your eyes 
and follow it. Just follow it. And eventually you will come to the river. My dog just smelled something. This is Lilu. You will get annoyed. Get, get to know her. So please, guys, let's continue. And we will find the river over there. I'm going to show it to you how to make the quick shelter. It's a long way, but I think I'm able to hear the river. Like I told you, it's not easy. It's not easy walk through those bodies, but it's safest way. It's the safest way. Trust me. So I need to continue. Stay focused. Be careful because a lot of danger around. But eventually I will come for sure. Never give up, never surrender. I'm exhausted, a little bit tired because I guess energy walking through this body but the river is over there, I can hear it. So, just a little bit more. And we on the river. Keep going. The river is here, I feel better, I feel more comfortable, it's not open space, like you can see, it's covered with the, with the, with the trees, but anyway, when I'm close to the river, I feel safe, I feel safer. Right now I'm, follow, I'm gonna follow the river downstream like always, I will find the best place where I'm gonna put the roof, 
against the against the urea, against the rain. So only that, and we are done with this video. I'm gonna make that roof simple, very fast. I think it's gonna rain. It doesn't look that, that way, but it's gonna it's gonna be raining. We are ready. You clearly you can see the grass laying down because of the water current I think yesterday or maybe day before over here it was like higher level of the water of this small river so I need to be careful the sky is not gray gray it's not dark it's, it doesn't look like it's gonna rain right away but you never know in the jungle you need to be careful because weather conditions could change in a minute okay
actually this side behind me is a perfect spot, almost perfect spot. Look at this, natural roof and we are below the high trees. So that part is okay. And a lot, a lot of lines, a lot of roots and easily to make the roof what I want to make. But where's the problem? We are on the bank of the, of the river. It's gonna be hard rain. The river will raise, rise up and wash, the, wash, the, wash us away. So we don't want to do that. Looks good, perfectly, but not for us. No way. I find a perfect spot for my quick shelter between those trees you will see right now a couple years ago when I, when I was filming in the Amazon rainforest um, I had with me one special type of hammock with roof and the mosquito net it was good it's normally uh, Colombian military use that when they are practicing military stuff inside the jungles I'm okay with that I was okay with that but sometimes because I'm uh, I'm European almost two meters long I'm a little bit bigger than average size of Colombian people so they are more comfortable inside those hammocks than me I was okay but sometimes because I was from the edge to the edge sometimes when I move during the night the rain from the roof get inside and it is frustrating in the middle of the night in the middle of the Amazon jungle so you can imagine after that lesson I start to use this combination this for the roof it's a Colombian military those sticks and ropes and with that goes hammock with mosquito net so it's very easy to put it where you want if you find the perfect place very protective against the against the rain and very comfortable so I tried it second time in Amazon jungle in Ecuador and from Mexico to, to Panama to Colombia all the way to inside um, Central America it was very good not a single drop enters in Costa Rica I had problems but it was my mistake not mis mistake of equi equipment so trust me combination of this perfect for the jungle conditions first of all you need to put a rope like a spine of the roof that you're gonna make it need to be very tight after that like you can see you put the roof this material that's gonna become your roof put it on the rope and you need to tie it very good the most important thing of the roof is, is this part what I call it spine of the roof this rope need to be with a good material and tie it up if you, if, if you have a belly down I call it belly the water we collect on that belly and eventually start leaking drop by drop and you trust me you don't want to feel that in the jungle so make sure that the spine is really tight and um, well done remember one thing always trying to find a good healthy tree where you're gonna put your shelter if you put your shelter on the rotten tree you put yourself in the danger and the other thing the uh, weak branch or trunk will bend because of your weight inside the hammock and you will make the belly on the roof and the water will start leaking and you will be wet you don't want to be wet in the jungle take care
this is my roof. I did it. It took it took it took me like five minutes. Normally, I do that when it's raining. I do that in min one minute and a half, very fast. But right now I didn't hurry. I didn't I didn't I wasn't in a hurry because perfect conditions. I had time. So the roof is is tight. All rain will fall down, slide down, and that end up on the floor. I will be perfectly safe, perfect, perfectly dry underneath it. So, see, it's very, 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 very easy. And all, all you have to do is a little bit of imagination and good equipment. And that's Right now I'm in shelter, in my shelter, under my roof, see? What can I do right now? On this trunk behind me I can put a hammock with a mosquito net and I can sleep. I will be perfectly safe, perfect, perfectly dry here, dry here. So, that's it. Easy. It's very easy. So, enjoy the nature. Vedran Bajan Adventure. Okay, my dear friends, my dear followers, that was it for, the, for this time, for this lesson. The roof is behind me. If you like it, give me a thumb up, like, subscribe, share, and help, help my work with the Patreon or PayPal donation. I am grateful to each one of you and support my work and I'm gonna make this kind of videos more and more because I have a lot of to share a lot of to, lot of to give free life free spirit veteran budget adventures let's go together <laughs>